future of online marketing this is what we will be discussing in today's short videos so let us understand what does the future holds for us the online marketer people first and foremost we would love to travel or this videos only with three contexts the market today the use cases and does it work and if so how so let us proceed with the market today per se now what is the market you look at market it is a mix is a portfolio of whatever is present uh, you need to understand promo station connects the consumer with ecosystem ecosystem is completely different for different consumer different for different individual different for different cultures consumer discovers promotion deals merchant promotes their products and services effectively at a lower cost through social media through mobile channel operation through local promotional plat platform when i say local it can be just an event one of event that you are going on a local basis media recognition informal forms a critical part of the platform and the consumer are active participation to it let's see the global marketplace amazon ebay we have the brokers as such the google adwords the nafnac we have the search engine to look forward to it you look at the ecosystem it does it not only has a social media it doesn't have only have the individual website the landing pages the mobile through which the traffic has been converted or been channelized we have the lo local promotional plan as the event the online global marketplace if we want to go around it the marketplace another global marketplace which is doing very good is alibaba we have the ad brokers we have the search engine which gives you the algorithm now this is what has been pampered to this consumer the consumer have different methods to access information different preferences also there probably uh, the consumer would not believe what the search engines are telling but consumer will surely succumb to what social media uh, influencers are doing around it so need to understand the digital marketing ecosystem in today's world that is one which is of prime importance so if we have done, understood the market let us understand the use cases and how does it help all together so you look at consumers you look merchants you look the companies as in the admin the consumers are looking at personalizing browsing experiences and i'm sure about it most of you who are watching this video will have a preference to a particular browser be it opera be it safari be it internet explorer be it google chrome i do not know but you have your browsing experience and based on your browser's acclimatization knowledge awareness you will be working around it next is most of us might be accessing the net through mobile some of us through desktop some of us through lap laptops some of us through tabs and this is challenging isn't it the consumers are so finicky now you need to understand how the consumer finds a deal probably through a promotional deals on a search engine probably through the landing page of a website or probably through a social media coupon that has been dis uh, distributed this is what we are looking into it the promotion deals the propagated merchant message as in the website the comment the question the remarks the search engine and obviously yes the self account on your email that comes around here so this is how which the consumer is actually accessing information availing information and probably making the requisite or should i say the suitable decision now, as a merchant as a business houses now what are we looking into it we need to understand what is our inventory and how do we promote it how do we ensure that our inventory is empty at the end of every week how do we ensure that the product has been uh, lapped up in the market through reporting through promotions and deals management through payment probably my inventory gets uh, it's get, it's getting empty every now and then but the payments is delayed so you need to understand every metrics around it the self service the account management and obviously the feedback from the customer so this is what the business is all about it between the consumers and the business or the merchants but then what happens to the digital marketer this is what digital marketer will help you to understand of the business about the consumer what are they looking into the front end or the back end ad admin through which the consumer is accessing information through which the merchants or the business houses are accessing information subscriber account management both for the merchants the businesses and the consumer the report generation as to what has been done and how it has been done how the data has been generated merchant account management 
customer inter 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 interactions, workforce management, search engine optimization. This are the works of digital marketers. This is what the digital marketer would generate, which will augment the managers of the business houses to take correct decision. Whatever is happening around here. The last scenario is, does this work? We have understood the market, which is very complex. We have understood the use cases as in how the information has been accessed and been utilized. Now we need to understand, does, is there a perfect marriage happening out there? Probably yes, the merchant payments information is registered backend. So you have the merchant registration, which will be managing the deals, the promotion, the search, the discovery, the search engine optimization, uh, the comments, the feedback. Now what are these? We are looking for it. We are only changing to get into the customer feedback and report generations, analyze those report generation. This is how the data has been enabled. Probably every time there's a digital marketing initiative, data have been collected to, for the interested, for the action button. What are we looking into it? The name of the person, the prob probable answer, the postal code, the region, the country, the business, the segment, billing information, IDs. If there are any complaints, the comments out there, the contact person's name, this is what we are looking to it, to it, right? Now, this can be done every time, probably for a social media ad or probably once in a time where you can always make an account and let the person go to your account, to his or her account and enables to understand what are the pres present deals of the best deal that is available. So merchant inputs are required for search engine, for Facebook, for uh, radio buttons, the subscriber RSS, the YouTube. Now this is where the merchant deals and promotion have been provided. Remember deals and promotion in today's world are being customized to the individual requirement and that can only be done if you have those factors in mind. Look what we are looking into it. The social media ads, it's been printed out here. It's been, sorry, it's not printed. It's been impaneled out here. So we can run our campaign in Google as in search engine in Twitter as in, as in social media or hashtag in Facebook or Instagram per se. And that is what we are looking forward to it. Every time there's a cookie been installed, we are ensuring that the focused customer has been targeted upon with relevant ad. Relevant ad that leads to a conversion, that leads to a sales generation. And that is what we all want it to be. Uh, right now, I've just given you a certain website, a number of websites, right from Toyota production of a search engines to a promo station to Toyota uh, advertisement to a YouTube advertisements. Now, what are we looking at into it? We are letting the customer know how we are accessing the customer's likelihood of watching the watching our promotion and grabbing his or her eyeballs to understand what are the deals that we are offering it out. And it can be done through a variety of media, right from YouTube to a search engine, to a proprietary landing page, to a digital marketers, n number of places. Why do we look? We want this result to be optimized. The search engine needs to be optimized completely. Again, now let us understand the front gate of the, uh, of the merchant marketing system. Now this is through the sales uh, promotion that comes around it. So this is through the social media as that comes around it, the blogger versions, the influencer talking around here, which will only attract or generate some kind of interest in your product or services, which is important, which is desired, which is to be required for. And that is what we all aspire to be. So, we would like to avail everything from the front end. What can the merchants do on the back end? What is it? It is all about report that has been generated. It is the report which need not be generated, but also needs to be analyzed, particularly segment together. This analysis is very important for the success of the next campaign. If the analysis goes wrong, the campaign does not yield a good return on investment. But if the analysis is proper and the return on investment is stupendous, you will ensure you will get hooked up with the digital marketing business. Why? Because with the amount of investment, the returns are magnifying enough.
than the other traditional medias are concerned. So merchant can individually pay or see what has been done, where it has been done, how it has been done, what can be tracked and what cannot be, and accordingly design a campaign for the next show, the next run. With this, I come to an end of this.